Welcome, everyone, and welcome back. So it's been, I don't know, maybe around uh, a week since I last posted my video. Um, yeah, I've been lazy. I don't know. So yeah, it's pressing my title. We're doing that. What if Venus orbited Earth? Oops, that was the sun. Let's get Venus. If you don't know, Venus is almost the same size as Earth, as you can see right here. So on time a bit. The moon's also here. So I put Venus uh, right here. Of course, Venus right away uh, is uh, kind of messing with the moon here. The moon actually may collide with Venus here. Oh no! Yep, there's Venus. I mean, the moon, not Venus. Fragments right here, yeah. You should create like little little moons. Yeah, that's around 200. Let's also get this fragment. You know, create some fragments. Oh. Oops. Oh wait, no, it's still there. I'm so sorry. There you go. Here, here. Convert. Alright, perfect. Let's go back to Earth. Alright. That one fragment is holding on is the other one, I guess, collided. I'm surprised it's so here. Venus is a... What a hellish world right now. It's not a pleasant place to be. I thought it had that collision with the moon. I'm surprised this fragment's still around. That's probably gonna collide. No? I'm surprised. Alright, speed up a bit. Ooh! Wow, that fragment's really hanging in there. Still? Oh, Venus. Nope. Oh, yeah. Nope. Are we, are we, no? Okay. I guess Venus kind of threw it out. I think these two are in a binary. Yeah. So it doesn't, it doesn't look like anything's really gonna happen. I can speed up time until like Venus becomes, you know, cool again, and we can see if Venus could be half have it all. I'm guessing not. Yeah. No. Still. Still quite a hot place. <laughs> so yeah, um, that's what would happen. Venus and Earth would be in a binary. I mean, they're around the same size, so it makes sense. Yeah, so if you enjoyed this video, um, uh, please like the video, and if you want, you can also s subscribe. That's your choice, though. Um, and yeah, I'll see you in the next one. See ya.